I'm still wondering if like the basis for the image of this map screen is like an actual photograph. And then they retraced or something already. Hey there one so cow playing Donkey Kong Land. I, I feel like it might be the last one. I don't know. Like there might be a surprise somewhere or something. So I don't wanna assume. I just that's just the general vibe I'm getting. Oh yeah, I did it. Destroy that beaver. Whoa, that beaver's here. Oh oil. Okay, so we got the oil factory gimmick. There's gonna be fire at some point. Fire it up. Look at that Kremlin bounce. What a fool. Is there anything lower though? Like I have to check. Alright, so we didn't abandon ropey challenge. Well there's a like they're supposed to bring like a thing here? And by a thing I mean like a barrel? Well there was only a DK barrel, but I mean no, there's another boarded up thing there. Look at that glorious grayscale fire! Oh, okay. Uh, it's not the same laws as the Super Nintendo counterpart. Not flame. Oh, jeez. All right. So run, 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 run. I just that that just don't does never feel good. Great. All right. That's a lot of qualitatives I put in a sentence when it wasn't always necessary. All right. Here I go. I'm surprised that didn't kill me. That it didn't despawn reality underneath me. I mean, that's the kind of thing that likes to happen here in Cincinnati. The Great Banana. Alright, check out. So hey, we're, whoa, we're reviewing some gimmicks here. We got ropes. We got nopes. So, oh, I think that's where you need to go. Like, that's just, yeah, that's just a wall texture. Alright, so how long... Eh, it's not super long, but I threw you beyond the door there, donkey. Hope you appreciate it. I don't know what to do from here. Oh, you can just jump from here. Okay. Look at that powerful jump that I'm displaying. Ah. Yeah, I know. I knew that was a miss. There's something about long jumps. Like, I don't know what it is, but I never feel comfortable. Like, something about the way that acceleration works, maybe. Like, I just, I genuinely don't know. Whenever I'm asked to do a jump long far, I I always don't want to do it. But, oh jeez. Okay, so I'm safe here. So, uh, like, the flame is gone for a very short time. It feels like. Well, I think maybe it's not that short, but it feels shorter because it's on fire for longer? That's something. Uh, what's up with that banana? Are you telling me something about this direction that I should be noticing? Because I'm not seeing anything from here. Alright, I'm just gonna go down a little bit more, just... No, I'm not really seeing anything. Oh, there's a... tire over here, though. Like, I saw a tire, right? That was... Uh... Yeah, this is Donkey Kong Country, just do your thing as soon as you get there, and you'll be fine. That's silly and felt super bad, I'm glad I only need to do that ever once. Oh, whoops, well, that was a long adventure inside uh, High B. Well, what? I had a donkey all this time? I forgot that you could have a buddy. Eh. How do you do that? Are you supposed to jump underneath it, or...? Hmm. Alright, well, whatever. There was probably a letter inside that bonus that I just kinda quickly cancelled out of as soon as I saw the second fish. Yeah, so just go. Just go. Don't worry about things. Like, by the way, that balloons just appear for a second before then floating beyond time and space. You know that this is a game where they want you to just hurry the heck up. So just hurry up. That's all you need to do. That's a hard jump, and then this is awkward. Okay, well, I did it. I got the midpoint beyond two. Totally deserved. Snakey shanty. Here we go. Really? 
<laughs> I managed to get Bob the... Like, to be fair, I wasn't looking there exactly. He, uh, well, uh, the Snakey Shane team. Here we go. So watch out about veering too far one direction. We got a very territorial snake there who really cares about that one tile of his. Here. If there is, I haven't seen it. Uh, oh. What? What killed me there? Side of the burning barrel? Wait, how are you supposed to time yourself with something you can't see? Um, this is... like... I can't see the barrel on top. I just gotta go. I just gotta trust the heart of the cards, man. Alright. Right. Just... Okay. Play- And the trick is to just go. Don't think. Thinking is for losers. So why is this like this? Because there's a crusher, maybe? I don't know, you know? Oh, maybe you're supposed to like blow up that barrel? Yeah! That lets you get here. Which lets you get here! Yeah! I solved that puzzle! Oh shoot, that one up. Oh shoot, all those one ups! Oh, I got one. Yeah! Two. You know what? I'll take the two, I guess. Biggers. Well, they can be choosers, but that's pretty rude, honestly. Uh, well, yeah, I, um, hmm. Alright, so here, be careful. I don't need to go back. So that's cool, because I got the thing. Ugh. Well, like... So it feels like doing the, the attack, like the roll attack, actually destroys your momentum. Which I feel like it should add to it, but it does the opposite, which might be part of what's been giving me grief throughout my experience of playing Donkey Kong Land for a Game Boy. Uh, alright, the arrow. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh, shit, I know, just fall off. I. I really? Why did that not work? Because the precision is just not there, man. There I, pr I pressed the button, but the game ignored me, that's fine. Ugh. Where's Crusher with all this? Like, seriously though, like, where is DK? Why why must all this be done solo? Like, I know it's the end of the game, but... <laughs> that's a pretty weak way to make things challenging, you know? Alright, so, how did I die? Somewhere... Yeah, I just kind of fell off, and it was embarrassing. There we go... And here we go, I died at the end as I explode inside the side of the building. This is, I, I don't know, like, I just, yeah, 98%. Like, I just don't feel like I have the precision the game thinks I do, even to this point. After playing this for, like, what, two weeks? There's something. Is this the boss? Yeah, hey, it's K. Rule, even. So I just had a system save. Oh, that's interesting. He... No, no donkey. Oh, you just get one for free. Okay. Alright, so that's not gonna work. Can barely see anything. Yeah, he's so small. What happened to you? I I'm playing super garbage. I'm aware of this. Oh, that was that was sad. All right, you did it. You solved it. Yeah, it's gonna run over here. Tiny little baby K rule. Like the screen crunch makes this kind of hard. Cause like you gotta be close to him to see what he's gonna be doing. Also, this is three jumps, and we're still doing this. It's like the fourth jump. Yeah, okay, we're still doing that? Alright, like, this is making me wonder if I'm doing the right thing, because, uh... No, I get it! I jump on your head, and you go, wagga wagga. Like, am I supposed to do something else? I can get hurt trying to figure that one out. That's my plan. Oh, what? You change your move, but... And I don't know how to react to it. Am I supposed to jump on your back? I don't know. Because, like, as long as I stay perfectly still, 
Looks like he's never gonna actually hurt me. Ah, there you go. Okay. Ah, dang it. Yeah, sorry, the camera wildly spinned around. And now at this point in the game, you're going crazy fast. Da Case in point. That's what I should do. Run ahead. And then you can treat him like a projectile. Alright, let's do that. Let's do that. I believe next time's gonna be when he's gonna be ground pounding, belly flopping. Yeah, see, it takes him a second. So for now, we just follow him around. Wait for him to resume throwing his crown like an idiot. I mean, I guess, like, I, I see why he changes his mode of attack, because, like, at some point, like, he's exerting a lot of... There we go. So now we go to the other side. Yeah, and we treat him like a projectile. He's fast enough that I feel like that's the best way to do. And there you anticipate. You don't react. You anticipate. There we go. Yeah. Gonna use this speed to your advantage. There you go. Dissipate. Huh? Ah! He plopped! He flopped! Oh, we get just the normal video game end music. Oh, it did it! Congratulations! So it was a bit of a puzzle, I guess? At some point, you just have to realize hey, if you can't react, work around that. Donkey Kong Land was a really strange experience. I'm glad I played it. But, like, I feel like it's just it, not as stable feeling as the Super Nintendo version, you know? Like, like, well, just the fact that you get Konami Scroll in a very harsh way sometimes. But, uh, the game does some really interesting things. There's a whole trilogy of Donkey Kong Land 1, 2, and 3. Uh, this one is pretty wild compared to the, okay, negative zone, to the first. Donkey Kong Land 2, I've heard, sticks a lot closer to its uh, great, uh, big sibling. And Donkey Kong 3, Land 3, is like, kind of in the middle. Yeah, 100%, I did it. I will be playing those games, because I want to, I want to experience them, but it's not gonna be next. The next thing we're gonna be playing, actually, like, look, believe me or not, you know, you know, smooth ROM hacks? Some of them are from other countries, including exotic locales like Japan. <laughs>